Hello everyone. Your top one famous locomotive engineer with BNSF 8399. And today we're doing a tutorial on a Gillig BRT bus. So what you're gonna need is black wool, stone button, polished blackstone slab, polished blackstone brick slab, dark oak trap door. Let's actually start with those. So add like spread it like three blocks apart on the ground. Add your stone button on the, the wheels. And then on your wheels add a three polished black stone brick slab. So for the middle, let's let's make this uh, eleven blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Actually, make it one more, cause, cause, cause that's gonna be the the axle for the 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 drive wheel, cause, which is this the real the dual drive wheel. Uh, two here and another two here cuz cuz I said this is how I made how I make a dual rear wheel how I made like dually rear ends let's make let's add another let's add six more of polished blackstone brick slab so one two three four five six Make this three blocks. Let's stop. Let's make this five right here, because we're adding trap doors. Because I want to like use gray banner as the muff flaps. Oh wait. I'm, oh, guys, never mind. Just use your dark oak trap door as your mud flaps. And then for this, only have the inner part, only have the inner part to have polished blackstone brick slab. <coughs> and then just fill in this layer because we're just making the frame. Just continue adding your three layers of, just keep adding your three blocks wide of polished blackstone brick slab so let's add four more polished blackstone brick slab so one two three four actually three right here is that's gonna be replaced with a polished blackstone slab again I'd just make a th I meant to make guys I meant to make a th 3x3 three three of polished blackstone brick slab. Let's stop right here because again the dark oak trap door will be your mud flaps. So guys I'm doing this tutorial. I'm making this color white. Again you can do it any color you want. Like for example I did my uh, Dodge Charger police car the last in my last video uh, for the purple I used the uh, purple stairs and slab let's get back to this and then add polished blackstone slab on the outer edges alright since we're done with the frame let's add three more slabs right here because that's going to be like your bike rack So let's start with oak door, white concrete, smooth quartz stair, and slab, uh, item frame, because obviously that's going to be like your headlights your and your tail lights. Get yellow concrete and red concrete, and dark oak sign, and a bedrock. So let's start with the door. Let's start with 
five blocks wide of white concrete, two item frames on each side, and then add your low and high beam lights right here. And then for the windshield, oh, you're going to need oh, black stained glass, five blocks wide. And then a uh, black stained pane, because honestly this is a BRT and the windshield's meant to be cornered. Uh, we still need that. And let's make the door. Let's add two here, because I love having dual doors. Crouch down on that trap door, and add a smooth quartz stair facing upside down. Oh, I forgot. Oh, yeah. Add a smooth court stair on this side as well. Same thing. And then let's extend this all the way to the back, to the rear driving wheel. Add a smooth court slab right here. White concrete in the middle. And then another two slabs. Let's make a 2 by 3 of white concrete and then and then this extend this all the way back to the front make like a big L shape like that so it makes contact with the windshield and then add two by two windows right here and then and then one one by two right here and let's fill in these pillars right here and then add another door. Add some other, so add more doors right there. And let's fill this in so we don't see the. How I did? Yep. You can make an interior if you want. Make this three blocks long. One, two, three. You know what? Let's fill in all this. So it makes like a floor. Add two bedrocks here. Same with this side. Oh. Make a 2 by 5 of white concrete. So get a dark oak sign as your route display. Add two item frames back here. Same with that. Add yellow concrete, that's your turn signal. Then red concrete as your brake lights and tail lights. Let's get a birch sign as your license plate right here. The sign on the left that's your license plate. Uh, let's add it let's add it to the front. Why not add it in the front? Like next to your headlights. Let's make a Oh, uh, let's make the three lines of bedrock. Uh, like white concrete surrounding this, and then four blocks long of white concrete once again, and add an L shape of white concrete, and then a bedrock right there, and then. We'll just add a window right here. Same with this side. Might as well fill in the other, the layer on the other side. So, like what I did for the driver's window, I just use black stained paint. That's what I used to like corner the windshield like that. And add. I see here that's gonna be your uh, driver's seat. I'll have a step to get up to the seat, which I use smooth quartz slab. In this case, uh, we don't. We, I still need that, and honestly, I don't need that, and I still, I don't need the door. So like, oh yeah, a two by two of white concrete. 
and then add oh four two by twos right there and then another three layers of black stain paint on this side it's completely blank so take a and a side wall as your smokestack right there you know what let's use a slab let's use slabs to fill in the the engine bay like a two, I meant make like a 2 by 3 of smooth quartz slab and then like for the sides of the roof let's use smooth quartz stairs and let's have this cornered right there same with this side and let's extend this all the way to the back and let's add in let's fill in these slabs actually you know what guys for the roof I love to make it a slab tall just like how I did my locomotives because I'd use this if you ever want more headroom on your ceiling how did I do this oh oh yeah at three three slabs across and have these trap doors face down because that's gonna be like your header sign and Jennifer my favorite bus driver if you're watching this this is I've successfully built our bus you're gonna be you're gonna be the one driving and again with this bus you can have it in any color you want because in this case we did white because that was like my easiest color to build uh, I decided to make the interior blank because you can turn to like almost any everything like anything you want <coughs> because for our bus Jennifer because this is my seat right here and if you want you can tell me in the comments if you ever want me to change the color that's a maybe so like that's pretty much it on how to build a Gillig BRT bus in Minecraft so thank you guys so much for watching and supporting the channel love you all like comment subscribe and turn on notifications please and I'll see you on the next one BNSF 8399 out.